I am ready to explore. Alright, so we should have a new area now. The Blossoming Arcadia. But I want to go back to Sun Speckled Terrace. There's at least more I can do here. I'm not sure if I can complete everything here yet. I might need other pigment types, but I have at least some stuff left to do. Still, uh, yeah, 58% remaining. There are onions to be found. There is treasure to be found. There are rescues to do. And we definitely need to collect more material because after those upgrades, I am a little bit more poor. But that's okay. Okay, so... What we'll start with is I want to grab... Let's say 2020. And I need to grab that onion that I found around the corner here. So I'm just gonna chuck all of my yellows on that and they can carry that back. Right. And you guys can carry this back. And then work on this. Poor? I am a little bit poor. Turn yellow. And now it's half yellow, half red. Cool. Second with the other onion? That was unexpected. You don't think that's going to be a problem, do you? Nope. Unbelievable. The onion's fused. Now there's just one with two colors. Do you think it's able to propagate pigment of both types now? Yes. I do believe that will be possible now. Which means... We can uh, work on growing yellows now. Oh my god, please. There we go. Are those gonna switch? They are. I might not get that in time, but it's fine. No, they did. They did. There we go. Alright, and that is the entire pile. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna have to... build this bridge, I guess. I wonder if they'll try to go back afterwards or if they'll stay here. We'll see. Also, I can cross that bridge and do some stuff over there now that I have yellows, I guess. So, just keep that in mind. There's also this thing. I like how they're neatly waiting. I'm gonna ignore you for now. Uh oh. Alright, they neatly jump off. You can work on that, and then there appears to be a pile hidden in here. So you guys can work on that. 
Oh, they're not gonna just drop it down, the pumpkin? Are you gonna carry it the entire way? No, you do drop it down here. Okay. I was gonna say, if you want to carry that all the way around, that would seemingly take quite a while. Okay, and that's my treasure gauge, right? Okay. There you go. Got the pumpkin. Um... I don't know that there's much else up there. I'm gonna try to complete... Oh, wait, there's a blue onion back there as well, I think. Oh, I guess we triggered the cutscene. Red alert! I see something. Or someone. And who is that next to them? Doesn't look like any of our rescue officers. Oh. Hey, what's going on here? What are they planning to do with the castaway? We need to rescue them in quick. Rex, we owe you. Let's go. So that's a new cave. Let's make sure I have the pile transported. I do. Okay. Um, yeah, I, I guess so. But yeah, there's definitely... How am I going to get there, though? All right, well, we'll worry about that later. Your pigment cannot join you. Unfinished tasks on the service will be called off. Okay, trial run. Um, sure, let's see how this works. Huh, what's going on here? Pigmen aren't following you for some reason. Guess you two are on your own. Good luck, Rexy. Use your Ochi. All right. You know, I kind of wish I was allowed to name Ochi, but story-wise it makes sense I'm not allowed to, seeing as it's technically the captain's dog and not ours. What is this place? I guess we can figure it out later. For now, let's focus on finding that castaway. What would I name Ochi? Mm. Pepis. I would steal your name and name it Pepis. I see them over there. Huh? It it turned it into a hairy little thing as well, but a purple one. What in the world? Those who not not embrace Dory cannot survive this planet. But if they grow the leaves, they will thrive. You skin having one. Do you believe you didn't need not need the leaves? I will test your abilities to see if this is true. I don't know what this means. I invite you to face me in Dendori battle. A fretted pigment you will need to support you in the challenges ahead. Listen closely. Find objects and transform them back to your base within the time limit. To win, collect the highest total combined weight. You wish to retrieve your castaway, prove that your Dendori abilities are superior to mine. Now the Dendori battle begins. Okay, this might be tough. I kind of don't like that it's showing me this split screen because I'm like missing a lot of screen real estate for very little benefit. Can you grab that? Rest of you keep grabbing that. All right. Wait, so you aren't actually sprouting more Pikmin, are you? Aha, uh -huh, I will take that. All right, all right, I guess not. Carry this. Come with me.
I don't know if I'm winning. Oh, there's more stuff that's spawning. Oh, wait, hold up. That's a lot of, like, gold chunks. Are those worth a lot? I wonder. Well, let's grab this. You can do fighting, I don't care. Uh, I don't think I want to, like, waste time breaking down the wall. Let's see if mine will snatch this. Yep, they will. Nice. I think this does grow more Pikmin. This apple. And grab this. Okay. He didn't put enough on here. So we can steal this. Wait. Get off of me. Bring this back. Oh, I'm winning. Oh, he has 69. He just went for the nice number. He just went for the nice number. It was like 69. That's good. I got 108. You won by at least 30. Okay. It's interesting. I don't like it as much as like bingo battle because there you're competing for specific things. And I think like going purely by weight rather than like value of things, that could be more interesting. But yeah, it's not bad. The strength of your Dendori power is magnificent. We'll return this one to you. They just left? Who in space and time was that? Well, whoever they are, they weren't lying. Your Dendori towns were on full display. Well, let's get this castaway out of here. Alright, we'll do. It's, it's a neat mode, though. It's like a nice little change of pace for your adventure. I just kind of wish it wasn't split screen. Because I think... Like, that makes sense if it's local versus. But... Since I'm playing a CPU, I... Yeah. I wish I could at least shift away from it. They really are growing leaves out of their head. Seem to be someone from the same condition as the leafy individual you just challenged. Huh? Leafy individual I challenged? I... I, I think someone's being called out. Transport them back to the SS Beagle right away. I still don't feel like I need... Ice right now. Alright. I get it. I mean, we did this now. Uh, I grabbed that. It's not much for me here right now.
Let's bring you back for now. I'm probably gonna set a different base, I think. It's gonna get affected that they have leaves growing out of their head, and their face is all well bushy. Let's check their ID info. Error. Unable to read data. What's this? Unable to read data. They should have biometric authentication, but this definitely is an issue. How are we supposed to find out who this is? Ask them. I, I, I know it sounds insane, right? Having to talk to someone, but like... I think it might be the solution here. Right, I definitely... Yeah, I would need 10 more ice pigment to freeze that. wonder where I could get ice pigment. Uh, I'm gonna move my base here. For a little bit. Oh, no. Right, actually. They might have wanted me to, like... Bump that down with Ochi, but... You know what? This works. Alright, you got it. Let's uh, enter this cave. Hectic hollow. Someone or something built a rough wall inside the cave. The pigmen and I weren't able to scramble up, but Moss was unable to climb up the wall. We'll have to leave behind for now and hope we can find another way to meet up. Okay, they did that. Yeah, let's let's try and enter. Uh, they recommend 30 red and 10 ice. Okay. That might mean we find more ice in here. And if we find 10 more ice, we can freeze the lake. And that should get us access to blue onion. So this seems like a good, good idea. Although I'm a little worried about them saying like their dog couldn't climb up somewhere. What is this? Okay, so it does have material in it. But that seems to be all. go yep that is five extra ice pikmin so that is uh moving up on things Look, can i freeze this i can wow how amazing is that the water froze almost instantaneously now you can travel across the top. Okay. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. So the ice can melt. Hmm. All right. Can you not target that? Like lock off of that carry it quickly I wonder if the ice only melts if you take your Pikmin back out? Because that wasn't entirely clear to me. Oh. I guess I can just dig... Oh no, they have to... 
have to use material to... Dig? Build a ladder? Climbing wall? Oh, okay. And my Pikmin can come with, but Ochi cannot. Got it. And since I cannot really bring them back anyway, I might as well just, like, do this. These guys. Alright, how about you die? And you die? And then I get more icy friends. Come with me. No? Okay. Push the box. Um, so now I could get Ochi back. Hey, hey, welcome in. How are you? Let's bring that back. Got done working out, eating now. Nice. What are you having for food? Okay, let's write you some spaghetti. Always good. Oh, hey, they found found something in the thing. That's neat. Um. Oh, I guess they can just get it out there. That's good. Wait for it to freeze. Put everyone on there. A doctor's appointment today. You're down 23 pounds and no longer our weight. Nice. Congrats. You've put in the effort and it's paying off. That That must be exciting as well. Uh, do I have any leaves back there still? Seven months of hard work. Yeah, I mean, no no reason you can't keep it going, right? I mean, if it's over seven months, it's shown that it's something you're doing consistently and in a healthy manner, and it isn't like some quick weight loss that you cannot keep up long term, so... Yeah. Proud of you. Alright, let me just confirm. Yeah, I have everything in this first sub-level. Let's head further down. Alright, so there is a castaway somewhere here. Let's make sure I get rid of uh, the jars too. Alright, that just gives me nectar. What is that thing? And why is this jar in particular shaking? Well, we took it out very quickly, actually. So that's good. I guess the jar was shaking because there were Pikmin inside. Which makes sense. Put 
Break it down, fellas. Hydro Jelly Burst? Oh, I guess what I should just do is uh, charge this and knock you off. Okay, they can reach. How's the game going so far? Ah, I'm really enjoying it, actually. It's it's different from the first three in some ways. Um, but not different in a bad way. Not necessarily in a better way either, but it's it's just a really good, enjoyable game. There's some nice quality of life things in it. Never gotten into Pikmin series, but glad to see you enjoying it. Yeah, Pikmin is one of my favorite series. Honestly. Pikmin 3, especially as in my top five games of all time. It's Officer Dingo. An officer who excels at solo missions. He's not a joiner by nature, but he'll show up and lend his physical abilities when need be. Knew it. I knew it was tough enough to make it. Dingo's a skilled ranger. Even though he doesn't use a rescue pup, he specializes in solo missions. One thing's for certain, rescue missions should be a lot easier with his help. Interesting. I wonder what he will provide us at base. Because calling basically gives us areas. Um, Captain lets us train Ochi. And then uh, the other guy lets us get upgrades and skills. I wonder what this guy does. Because I'm going to imagine there's something. Right, nothing in there. One thing I do dislike about the stopping after you have the right amount is that it really does not seem to be very much a fan of putting extra Pikmin on a thing. Because you can usually put more than the minimum weight and putting like beyond the minimum weight on there does not seem to work super well. But like that's a relatively minor complaint. Do I have everything? I do. Okay. Back to the service. And that's our pup drive up by one, so we should be able to get the skills we wanted to get. Mama doll head, empty face. Oh, it's the doll together. That's clever. I didn't realize that when we got the first thing or when we got the empty face. But yeah, now that I see it in my treasure list, that makes sense. Aspiration ritual pole. Right. It's good. We got uh, 20 blues out of that. Which is really solid. Because now we should have enough to freeze that water. There was some other water we could freeze too. I think I'll try to just take blues out. Even though I am, like, leaving f the option for 10 extra. Um, but if I just have blues, then I shouldn't be at risk of... Um... What do I want to say? I shouldn't be at risk of... Oh, what? That puts me back here. Okay, wait. Wait, but Poochie can... S no, we cannot swim. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Okay. I mean, he looked like he wanted to swim. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Why did he look like he can swim then? Because he goes very far in the water. 
they should be very much like that should be much more clearly indicated we lost all of our flowers because of that too which kind of stings wait but I cannot jump high enough for this So what can I do here then? I'm trying to think what is even the point of it. I guess I need to build that. But I probably cannot do that. Oh my god, I just realized they better not um They better not get stuck over there. They better all make it. Because I cannot go back now. Okay, hold on. But there was other water here. I'm just going to have to hope those six are okay. Yeah, there was this water here. How many does this take? 20, okay. Oh no. Oh no. Oh hey! Is that one of the cosplays with leaves growing out of your head? Dundori, Dundori! Oh, you want to do Dundori? They dug into the hole. Perhaps the leaving this caused disorientation. Rescue him quickly. Oh shoot. Uh I don't know what's gonna happen to my six. Okay. Well, let's try. I have no idea what's what's going to happen with those. Not not these 24, I'm not worried about those, but the six that were on the spicy berry plant. Cause I thought they could use the geyser, but it said that they were struggling. And I don't have enough like ice pigment to like freeze the water without them so i can't go and rescue them this place is for testing dendori do more dendori improve dendori simple goal carry as much as you can until time ends that's all treasure here all fake you cannot carry home pigment here all mine you cannot take home this means can dendori forever this is bliss for me and you do well get raw material do not well also get raw material Rare right, pigment i just 100 the first area hope you have so much fun with the game Thank you, thank you. I've been having a good time with it so far. I haven't left the first area yet. Um, I think I was at like... 40-ish percent or so. There we go. Carry that back. Do I have a specific goal for a certain amount? I don't know. All of you, come with me. Oh, they're not listening to me at all. Wait, what? Why are there so many Pikmin dying? Wait, did they, like, try to just attack things on their own? Are these mine that were from earlier? Whatever. These are not my Pikmin anyway, right? This is your first Pikmin game? Oh, man. I I really love uh, all of them. Pikmin 3 especially is really good, though. Why? Why is there one stuck on this? Actually, I guess I want... You guys to uh, organize. I feel like I'm doing really bad at this right now. 
I guess because you keep just going off on your own. Doing things and dying to enemies. So I guess if I were to do this again, I probably would want to just make sure I collect everything and grab all the treasure first. Also, like, I wanted you to get this. Come on, help with that. And there's still, like, this one pigment stuck on that. All right, now go, go and collect everything here. Oh my God. They really just had to go on the wrong thing, huh? Ochi, are you actually helping? Ochi, if you actually help, you can carry this. Thank you. Oh, and there were some hidden here. Okay. I can definitely do this way better. I think also there were like eggs. Yeah, there. Which I probably should have used to like flower some. And that would have helped. Oh, didn't throw three. There we go, pop nuggets. Break this now. Try and make the path a little bit faster. Or there's a bunch in there as well still. I could definitely do this way better if I uh, do it again. And then all of you go on this. And there's something buried there as well. Oh my god. I'm not gonna get that in time. Whatever. Uh, I got gold. I can probably do platinum on that. If I try. But I might go back for these Dendori Day Caves later. I hope there's like a menu somewhere. Where you can go through the Dendori Caves. Because that would be really cool if you could just see all of them, see your scores, and easily access them. Not this taking you seven tries. I've played a lot of Pikmin <laughs> over the years, so don't, don't worry. You work too fast, I feel dizzy. Take these 30 pieces of raw material, this is your reward. That is fun, though. I might have fainted. I wonder what caused that. Well, I guess this is our chance to get them out of here. How am I going to get them across, though? Thanks so much for the follow. I got 137 on your seventh attempt. I think I missed that green ball you got. Uh, well, that's still, you know, you, you got it in the end. And, you know, working and improving. That's at least in the mission mode levels in the previous games. That was kind of the goal, right? You weren't necessarily expected to do super well your first try, but by learning the level layout, you got to optimize your pathing a bit more. Dole at Leap Growth, there's no way to tell who that is, but it doesn't matter. It's our job to rescue them. We don't want them finding their way back inside that cave. Let's keep the lid closed as a precaution. All right. 
oh i can pick what pikmins i want okay that's good because i uh definitely had some ice ones stuck somewhere let's bring 10 reds for now all right um so All right, this is as many as you can have, okay. Freeze the lake, carry across. Whistle you back. And then ice is gonna melt and that's fine. I love the multitasking of the mode. The enemies were what tripped you up. Yeah, I mean, you'll you'll get better over time. So yeah, I... Uh, I don't... Uh, this would be really difficult. Huh? Another DP Cosway. Hopefully their ID will tell us something. Nope. No luck. I wonder... All right, I want to test something. I want to test if I put you in the water, would it stay frozen? Or is it still going to def like melt at some point? Let's just keep an eye on that for a little bit. Looks like it might still melt. Or not? Okay, so while they're on there, it doesn't melt. Okay. Okay, so while the ice pigment are in the water, it never melts. Once you take them out, that's when it starts melting. Okay. I see, I see. That makes sense. So we just leave you guys in there. Uh, I'm not sure if we have enough time for that. I love the sound design of the game. I keep tapping out because I love the little noises. They're very fun. Oh yeah, no, it, it it's good. Like, visually, sound-wise, gameplay, like, Pikmin is just so good. I, I, I love the games a lot. And you know, it only took me 10 years to finally be allowed to play a new Pikmin. Wait, did my Pikmin come up with me? Okay, I was gonna say. Oh, it's going to require 20. Okay. So I cannot do this yet. So I cannot do this yet. Okay. Because I would need to bring 20 with me. So I need to be allowed to have 50 out in the field to be able to do that. Alright. Uh, what do I do then? Hold on. Let me check my map, actually. So there is this, which I want to work on, but I need 10 more Pikmin. I've done, I think, everything in that area. I guess there's that bridge. Yeah, I guess building that bridge would be my next goal. I'm not sure that I have the time to do that today. Because we are about to enter like last 10 seconds. Find a way to get the blue one in with only 40 Pikmin. Ah, it's okay.
I guess, like... <sighs> I can't get Ochi up the climbing wall. And Ochi doesn't jump high enough for the other ledge. But if I increase Ochi's carrying weight to 10, then I would... He would be able to carry it across the frozen lake at least. And it could use 10 extra ice to grab it and dig it out on the other side to carry it down to where Ochi is. Something like that might be possible, but like... Eh, it's fine. I'm not that worried. Alright, please finish this bridge. Good job. Is there a base here? That I can quickly claim? Doesn't look like it. There might be one up this hill or something. Okay. That's fine, that was good. Thanks so much for the follow. Trying to pace yourself, since Lord knows we'll get another Penguin game in 2033. Always an optimist, huh? It took us 10 years for Pikmin 4 since Pikmin 3, I think. So, I'm not holding my breath. Hopefully it sells really well, is all I can say. Because then we might get another one a little bit quicker. But yeah, we rescued two mystery people and then Dingo. There's poisonous oxygen in these plants, I'm sure. They shouldn't be able to survive without their helmet. Something very strange is going on here. Yeah, we didn't get that much today. Perforated raft, mysterious carriage, orb of destruction. Yeah, that's fitting. 84%. We doubled our progress in one day. It's pretty nice. They've been marketing this game a ton. Plus all the fans buying those videos from for New York Times Square. Wait, people bought videos for New York Times Square? Like, I, I saw the meme of someone doing that with, like, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog video with some profanity, where clearly that thing did not have a profanity filter. Can't believe... I had to be saved by newbie. I'm losing my edge. But uh, I didn't know about Pikmin stuff. In my 30s, I've been blessed to play all four. Now your son gets to enjoy Pikmin as well. Nice. Yeah, I, I've, I've really loved all of the first three. So I'm glad that I finally got to play the four. Oh, the audio is fake. Uh, that's a shame. But that's still cool. <laughs> the greatest thing in New York right now. Just glad to see you made it back and safe or something. Are you hurt at all? Oh, uh, not at all, Captain. I'm just touched that you care. Hmm. Stable does not seem to be structuring sound. It's missing screws. But science guy could stand to worry a little more. Uh, that reminds me, Captain. I have some information regarding our pilot. Really? Do you know his whereabouts? What? Uh, no. Not that exactly. You must be exhausted from all that forced sleep you had. We'll go over the deals tomorrow. Get some rest. Oh, oh you got it, Captain. She cares about my physical state. That means... She cares! Oh, before you hit the A, please be sure to review all the details related to a rescue mission. Yeah, yeah. Is that really necessary? Oh. On another note, do we have any updates on that causeway we picked up today? The one with all the leaves? Allez. Right now, they're sleeping in the back. Their condition remains unchanged. Don't worry, I'll keep a close eye on them. Very well. Just make sure we get this castaway examined by the doctor as soon as possible. I guess we need the doctor rescued, which is one of the two we don't know about yet. 